Assalamu alaikum Khabib Hassan here from London I just want to say uh, all the best for the fight and after the fight and your future career inshallah may God always be with you it's clear that he is with you and that you are going from strength to strength inshallah now I used to be a Connor fan I wasn't aware of you and then obviously you were quite uh, on the scene and you've proved your worth and you've got up to the top with hard work determination and mashallah not only all of that great fighting but your character this is what uh, has made me sort of admire you from afar and I think millions of people can see that about you don't ever lose that that's the first thing I would like to uh, convey to you inshallah because you know that uh, the role mo the role model uh, you play I know you say you're not perfect we all we all not perfect okay uh, so my message to you uh, my dear brother thank you for allowing me to to give you this message in fact the whole day today at uh, at work I was talking to some of my English friends who are actually supporting Connor and uh, I'm supporting you uh, for a multitude of reasons uh, one of the reasons I'm supporting you is uh, because of your akhlaq, your character, your personality, how good and humble you are, right? And this will, I think this is in your DNA and this will never change. So to become like Connor, this is impossible. This is not your way. This is not your, uh, you know, your forefather's way. So uh, I'm not comparing you to Connor. Uh, Connor, uh, he's an amazing athlete. We know about the left jab and all of that. Uh, I do, I am concerned about that, right? But please, listen to me, listen to me. My brother, if you get a chance to take him down and grapple, don't punish him, don't maul him, finish the game, okay? Because whether you like it or not, he's going to come in and he's going to catch you here or there, okay? I'm sure you prepared for it, but don't allow him any, any time to have those opportunities, okay? So, these few words, Wallahi, I, uh, I have so much to say. In fact, we are welcoming you to London. Come to London. There's hundreds of, I'm sure thousands of people who want to meet you here. Come, Bismillah. We will host you. We will, we will look after you. I'm sure there's people here you already know. But Bismillah, we would love to, to, to welcome you with open arms to our beautiful city. Inshallah. We wish you all the best. Be safe, Inshallah. One other thing. After the match, if he wins, which I doubt it, uh, then let there be good blood. It's really important. There's no bad blood, right? It's uh, really important for the world to see how we can forgive and we don't have this hatred and enmity in us and stuff. I'm sure you got beef with him and all of that. That's fine. But if he loses and you smash him, then... Do what you always do. Show the world that it's not a one-off, that you go to your opponent and you say, hey, well done, and you lift their hands up. And you say, champ, I know I've won, but good, good, you know, good fight. Let them see, because this is the akhlaq that we know. This is the, the character that we've been taught by the Prophet. Beautiful character. And millions are watching you, not with a bottle of whiskey, like him. Your uh, intoxication, your intoxication is your beautiful manner and your calm, uh, pure heart. Yes, you are strong like a bear, but you are gentle like an angel because of your salah, because you pray, because you do dhikr, because you read Quran. Because you're kind to your mother, to your father, to your family, to your friends. This is what makes you beautiful. So I hope that Connor can learn from you. And maybe you can also learn from him. Maybe. Because we should learn from each other. You know, ultimately I'd like to see you guys be friends. And train other athletes. To become great fighters. For the legacy. For this, this whole world. It's not about, you know, we as human beings, we shouldn't be, yes, when you get into the octagon, 
you fight till the end but there's a gentleman nature about it when it's finished so you know let's all from both sides let us look at it as a very beautiful opportunity to see a great fighters come together fair one on one location is now here mashallah so wallahi we are with you we wish you well so my people at work are asking me why you uh, support habib i said because uh, not only because he's muslim so you happen to be muslim that's fine but i actually support you because of your way right i do like connor when i didn't know about you my brother i'm sorry i liked connor because of his there's something about him you know not his craziness that is good entertainment and all of that but there's something about his drive and his tenacity and all of that you'll smash him i know that but if you get the opportunity to take him down finish him off i know it's a long message wallahi i hope you can take some of this uh, from your humble brother in london we love you we love your family we love dagestan and most of all i love the dagestan dance it is incredible assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh from london town